Well, hello again all the boys and girls out there in YouTube land watching. Georgia Bear Reviews, back at you today <clears throat> with another one. And what I'm looking at is the Innocent Gun Bourbon Barrel Porter. It is 7.4% alcohol by volume. I'm not sure what the IBUs are. I looked at the Innocent, Gid, uh, Innocent Gun website and I could not even find this beer on the website, which I thought was a little bit strange because I'm pretty sure this beer has been around for many years. I have had this beer before, but it's been a little while. A little bit about this beer. It says that this bourbon barrel porter is the coming together of Kentucky and Tennessee bourbon barrels and Scottish craft beer. It's matured using our unique barrel aging process to give it a depth of flavor with notes of chocolate, vanilla, and orange. It doesn't say how long they put it in the barrels for. Innocent Gun makes great beer. I've had a lot of their beers. They're original. Innocent Gun barrel aged. Scottish Ale is really good. They make uh, they make a lot of really good barrel aged beers. And they were the, one of the first ones to do it as well. And the popularity of barrel aged beers has just skyrocketed within the last five to ten years. All right. So, it's a good looking porter in the glass there. A nice dark brown appearance. When I hold it up to the light, I can definitely see, uh, see through it. So it's pretty clear in that sense. I mean, it's obviously, it's a pretty dark beer. A few streaming bubbles going off the glass. A nice finger's worth of a relatively creamy looking tan head. The aroma. It's got that innocent gun barrel aroma that just it's unique in its own way if you gave me any barrel aged innocent gun beer blindfolded me I feel like I would just be able to tell you that it's innocent gun it just has such a unique barrel note a sweetness a maltiness on the aroma that you just don't get with some other beers nice and roasty nice and malty a little bit of barrel presence doesn't smell like it's going to have any real hot bite or bitterness to it just from the aroma smells like a winner so without further ado let's get into this brew cheers guys oh yeah the barrel notes that sweet malty flavor up front a little bit of smokiness nice roastiness in the middle of the sip from the roasted malt the finish is smooth and kind of in between wet and dry it's not a real dry finish it's not a wet finish either it doesn't really have any bitterness just a touch to balance it out but it's definitely more of a malty beer the barrel notes are coming through the 7.4 percent alcohol is nowhere to be found in this at all absolutely no alcohol presence mm. Man, I know this is probably a poor descriptor, but that unique flavor that I get from Innocent Gun, is just, they have such great malty beers. The original, the rum age, the rum cask, this one, almost have like a cola type thing to them. I'm not saying this tastes like Coca-Cola, but it has like a sweetness to it. A maltiness that one might attribute to like a cola flavor. But, I mean, this is just an incredible beer. It really is. This is one of the better porters I've had in a while. And the fact that they mask the alcohol so well, you get the barrel notes, you get the roast, you get that malt forward presentation which I prefer with my porters and stouts I'm not a really big fan of super bitter porters and stouts which there's a lot of them out there this is definitely not one of them I'm gonna go with a 97 out of 100 this is absolutely an incredible beer the body is actually relatively light as well so you could drink a few of these just gotta be careful because the alcohol is so high um, the carbonation is light almost medium but really easy drinking for such a high alcohol beer and 
if you like darker beers, if you like barrel-aged beers, if you like porters, if you like stouts, then you cannot go wrong with the Innocent Gun barrel-aged bourbon barrel porter. Buy it. Try it. Let me know what you guys think. 97 out of 100. That'll do it for this beer review. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. And until next time, everybody, cheers.